guys, it's Lita. Um, so this is my question and answer video. Uh, there were so many questions that I wanted to answer. I just picked out some really cool ones. Uh, so, yeah. Oh, and my hair is half black because Nathan and I did it last night. I mean, did my hair. Question number one. Do you find it annoying when people copy your style? Personally, I think the your style thing is a little bit, um, no, I, it doesn't annoy me. <laughs> Technically, it's not my style. There are a lot of people who probably look very similar to me in style stuff, so. Question number two. How long have you and Nate been together? Uh, actually, it was our one year, five month anniversary on the 11th of this month, so like, um, five days ago was our one year five month anniversary so yeah question number three this question was asked a lot um how do you keep your hair so healthy and it is actually pretty healthy for how many times i've bleached it and dyed it uh but basically i've learned that the main trick for keeping my hair really healthy this may sound kind of gross to some people but <clears throat> basically after i bleach it i don't wash my hair for like four or five days uh, because the natural oil from my hair uh, kind of repairs it. But aside from that, also protein spray and deep conditioning during the week that you first bleach it and afterwards. So, yeah. Question number four. This one was asked probably one of the most out of all the questions is how did you lose all of your weight when you were younger and stuff? I lost... I lost a bunch of weight once and then gained my weight back and then lost it again. Um, pretty much I just like cut my diet down to um, fruits and vegetables only a, like a few a day and drank a lot of liquids <laughs> to keep myself filled up and I walked and worked out a ton. It wasn't necessarily starving myself because I know a lot of people I've seen uh, have been like, yeah, Lita lost her weight by starving yourself. It's like, mm -hmm. Not really. Anyway, so, question number five. What do you play in World of Warcraft, and do you PvP or raid? My main is a uh, Shadow Priest right now. Yeah, it is a Shadow Priest. Um, and she kicks ass. And I am a total PvPer, like, completely PvP. I really don't like dungeons and raids and stuff. It's Yeah, so, PvP, yeah. Question number something. Are you going to marry Nathan? What is the worst gift you've ever received? Well, I'm gonna have to say, like, I'm sorry, Dad, but one time my dad gave me a, um, a, toothpa a toothpaste squeezer for Christmas, um, and I, like, really wanted this Transformers action figure <laughs> when I was, like, I think I was, like, five or six, and he was just like, hey, here's a toothpaste squeezer, boo! And I was like, ah, that sucks, so. Yeah. Next question, how did you become internet famous? Uh, I'm pretty sure it's just because I started taking some really cool pictures and I also dyed my hair a ton and just come up with some really cool makeup ideas and stuff. But to be honest, I'm not really sure how. I know I got a lot of help from like my friend Alex, who I love, but um, yeah. And some people are like, oh, she's only famous because she's dating Nathan. And it's like, uh, no, not really because uh, people... I guess knew who I was before I started dating him. So. Next question. Where do you buy your extensions? I love Sally Beauty Supply. Yeah, Sally Beauty Supply is like my favorite place to get everything and anything. So, uh, Sally Beauty Supply is where I get all my extensions, always. And I only wear human extensions, not the synthetic, synthetic ones, because those just, they're poopy. Who is your biggest inspiration? Helena Bonham Carter. I think she's just like the most amazing person. It's it's mostly just how like confident she is about herself, uh, and just how she's not afraid to like look completely like whoa, and she's still just like I'm so cool, and it's just yeah. So Helena Bonham Carter, favorite brand of toothpaste. I like Crest. <laughs> okay, if you could have one superpower for 24 hours, what would it be? I think it would be to shapeshift because I think it would be really cool to be like, I'm a cat, I'm a bee, I'm a bird, I'm a turtle, or a rock. Uh, can you tell us about your parents? 
yes, I can. <laughs> um, pretty much, my mom is really hot. Well, yeah, I'm I'm serious though. She's she's like super gorgeous, and I'm I'm jealous of her uh, in some aspects. Yeah, and she's really pretty. Anyway, uh, but she's a therapist for um, people. I'll I'll put her in a video sometime. But she's kind of in a bad mood today, so. My dad is like a really cool dude. He's actually like super really weird. Um like really weird. Like he's kind of like whoa. Whoa kind of dude. So, um but he's bald. Yeah, he looks a little bit like Mr. Clean. Um and he's a uh teacher for emotionally disturbed high school students. But he's really cool. And here's a picture of him. He's so bald. And those are my puppies, Prince and Loki. How do you keep your skin so clear? Uh, sometimes it's not, uh, but you know, that just shit happens. Um, but mostly I use, uh, like, a facial mask, like, twice a week. And then, um, I use this MAC cleansing gel, like, MAC brand cleansing gel that I put on every night to, like, clean my face of everything. And... Then I just wash my face a lot, um, and whenever it gets like oily, I'm just like. Bup, 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 bup. So, what brands of hair dye do you use? Uh, well, mostly I use Manic Panic and Punky Color. Those are my two absolute favorites. Like this is Manic Pan, I mean Punky Color, Flamingo Pink, and this is just L'Oreal Black. <laughs> um, but yeah, most of the time I use Manic Panic Punky Color. Sometimes I use Special Effects Hair Dye. And for the red that I had last time that you guys unfortunately didn't see, it was Splat, which is kind of a cheaper brand. Um, it works really well at first, but then it fades like that. So, my favorite is Manic Panic and Punky Color. And Punky Color smells delicious, so that's another reason I love it so much. Ugh, hate this question. How does the word ointment... Ointment make you feel? Um, whoever asked this question, you hit me right where it hurts because ointment is actually my least favorite word on the planet besides fetus. But I kind of like fetus because it's kind of funny. But ointment is just straight up disgusting. Like, if someone's just like, let me rub this ointment onto you, I'm like, fuck no. So, I hate that word so much. And Serena actually got me into hating the word moist too because it's just kind of like, oh, ugh. Uh, moist ointment. Oh, uh, no. So, yeah. I don't like ointment at all. Um, in love with you now. No, as you can see, he is not here. Um, he lives about six minutes away from me. That way. Is, um, what are your greatest fears? Uh, I'd say that my two greatest fears are, um, spiders. I hate spiders so much. Like, I'm okay drawing them because they don't look that scary when they're being drawn, but, um, pictures and when there's an actual spider, like, up in my face, I'm just like, crap my pants, run, it's really scary. I hate spiders so much because they're just like, and it's worse. Like, one time there was, like, a spider here on my computer while I was playing WoW, and, um, it was like a daddy long leg, and I looked at it. And then I shut my computer lid on it and threw my computer across the room. <laughs> also, my biggest, 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 biggest fear is um, things underwater. Like, I can't watch the Titanic, or like the beginning of the Titanic with the, the boat underwater because I'll just like freak the hell out. Um, and I can't look at the undersides of boats in harbors or rocks at the bottom of a lake or like sticks coming out of a lake or like chains coming off of a boat and going underwater. Um, it's making me freak out just like by thinking about it and like I can't watch Pirates of the Caribbean really without getting scared. Um, or when I go underwater while I'm playing WoW, I'm like, oh god. Well, I love you guys so much and I hope you, I mean, I hope I got to answer some of your questions and if I didn't get to answer your question, I'm sorry. But, you know, I'll try again later. So, yeah. Okay. Well, I love you guys. Bye.